Meghan Markle faced criticism from Australian author Germaine Greer when she shockingly claimed that the Duchess of Sussex would bolt from the stifling and anachronistic royal family. Meghan Markle and Prince Harry are now happily married, and excitedly expecting the arrival of their royal baby. However, before their royal wedding in May 2018, Australian critic Germaine Greer went public with her claim that the Duchess of Sussex will bolt from the royal family. In a 2018 interview with Australian program 60 Minutes, Ems Greer said, It's nearly always a question of the non-royal running for the hills just to get away from the whole thing. It's horrible, it's anachronistic. In a reference to Meghan's first marriage, which ended in 2013, she added, I think she'll bolt. She bolted before. Ems Greer added, I hope in a way that she'll bolt but maybe she'll take Harry with her. However, her claims were quickly rubbished by royal commentators. Podcast Royals from Australian Magazine New Idea Heard from royal commentator Angela Mollard, who gave her opinion on the shock claims from Ems Greer. New Idea editor Francis Sheen asked Ems Mollard, Do you think that's true? She replied, I don't know. I couldn't guarantee, no one could, that this marriage will last. They come from hugely different backgrounds. I think she's had a lot of freedom in her life to do what she wants to do. Royal life isn't free. It's obligation, it's duty, I imagine it's terribly boring. I think it will depend on the strength of their communication as a couple and whether they turn inwards to one another rather than outward. Ems Mollard also called the suggestion that Harry would follow Meghan ridiculous, adding, Well, Harry can't bolt, he's part of the royal family. She continued, I think the greatest thing in their favor is they're a long way down the line. That gives them huge freedom, they can do their own thing and I think that's the greatest thing in their favor. She concluded, I hope they last. Give the girl a chance. Give her a chance to prove herself.